What up, team players? It's your homie C Rod, and I got an epic lineup of Dragon Ball Super products that Bandai has announced in this video for you so that you are ready for the awesome Dragon Ball chaos that's going to be coming around this year in 2023. We got everything from the Zenkai set 4 that Bandai is actually already showcasing some cards like this cool Vegeta and Goku leader that just looks completely busted. Let me know what you guys think about that leader in the comment section below. And of course, we're going to be going over the Goku Black ultimate deck that they did announce as well and we also have news on the premium anniversary box you guys already know the anniversary boxes come hot and there's going to be a lot of limited edition cards in that set so you definitely want to keep note on that and i even got a little bit of news on things coming out in set Five of zenkai series so if you are prepared you will be able to get all the awesome products on time so that you are not breaking the bank later on like some of our friends unfortunately have to deal with when it comes to the collector's box so i got you covered in this video let's get started all right we're gonna start off with zenkai set Four. Now Zenkai set 4 is hype and I'm going to give you a little bit of information that I know. So Zenkai set 4 is going to be revolving around the Z stack ability. We're going to get more cards with that keyword skill. And if you guys don't know what the Z stack ability is, it pretty much is whenever you bring out a Z battle card from the new Z deck, you're able to get a card and place it right under the Z battle card. That is the Z stack mechanic and we're going to get a lot of support from that and set four is going to be revolving around characters that come back to life during battle so we're going to be seeing characters like uh cell because you know that he got blown up and then he came back to life we're going to be having cool cards like majin buu because you already know majin buu gets blown into pieces and turns back and regenerates and one of the hottest features and the one that Bandai themselves is hyping up is a character called Super Oob. Now, he's going to be one of the hot ones and one of the characters that they are really going to be trying to promote in this newest set. So let me know what you guys think about Zenkai set 4. They are already revealing some awesome cards. These are some of the awesome cards that they are showcasing right now. Of course, there's going to be a lot more. And of course, the hypest thing is that there is a god rare in this set. So make sure you guys get your collector fingers ready because god rares are usually worth a ridiculous amount if you are lucky enough to pull one. Unfortunately for me, I haven't pulled one yet and I've been opening so many boxes guys. But maybe Zenkai set 4, I'm gonna get lucky. Now, talking about the God Rare that's going to be in Set 4, they did mention that Set 4 God Rare is going to be a iconic scene, one of the most famous scenes in Dragon Ball and all of Dragon Ball. So I'm thinking, what is one of the most hypest scenes in all of Dragon Ball? One of the most famous scenes. There's so many... And I just can't think of one, but if I were to put a finger on it, you know what? I'm going to say Gohan Beast because it is the most recent hypest scene and uh, it is pretty famous at the moment. But I don't know. You let me know in the comment section below what famous scene would you like to see as the God Rare in Zenkai Set 4? So that's Zenkai Set 4. If you guys want to keep up to the latest news that Dragon Ball is actually dropping, make sure to follow us, subscribe, and give me a like if you really enjoy these type of videos where I give you pretty much all the information in one take. So let's keep on going with the newest hype. So we have the ultimate deck guys now this ultimate deck is going to be based around goku black and goku black is actually one of my favorite evil villains from dragon ball super so i'm pretty excited about this one and goku black is now getting a z awakening what are your thoughts about this awesome ultimate deck if you guys don't know the ultimate deck comes with 58 cards total 
and a booster pack. So not only will you be having the awesome all hollow deck, because in the ultimate deck, all the cards come in hollow, you're also going to get a chance to maybe pull a god rare, because a god rare is going to be featured. So I'm, st I'm, I'm, I'm pretty excited, guys. So if you're a brand new player to Dragon Ball Super Card Game, I would 100% without a doubt recommend that Goku Black Ultimate Deck because not only is it all shiny, so you're going to start off with an all blinked out deck, on top of that, you're going to get 7Z cards. So you're going to be having a full set of your Z deck ready to go, buy two of these, and you're looking at a pretty darn strong deck. What's the cherry on top about this right here is that the ultimate deck comes with one random gold foiling card. So you're going to be getting a chance to get some extra exclusive rare cards that are going to be highly sought after for any Goku Black fan or collector out there. So if you want to have an all blinged out god deck, well, this is going to be your chance. This is going to be coming around May 19. So mark that on your calendar to get one of the best decks coming out. Next up, we have the anniversary box and the anniversary box is one that collectors must have and it's going to be a beautiful addition to your Dragon Ball Super Collection. So the premium anniversary box is going to have over 100 exclusive cards and over 90 of them are going to be brand new cards. What really catch my attention in this anniversary box is that there's going to be a secret rare in here with an extremely low pull rate. So it's going to be a super rare card. And on top of that, there's going to be a special Z card set that's going to be having a brand new card type called the Z extra cards. So based on what I did find all over the internet, the Z extra cards are going to have a brand new design and on top of that, we're going to be getting a lot of support from up to 10 different type of archetypes. So if you have any of your old decks lying around, just know that we're going to be getting support with those old decks. So you players out there that are veterans and have your Dragon Ball deck in the closet could probably take it out again, add some of these new cards, and you're going to be ready for the tournament scene yet again. So if any of you guys are out there ready for that anniversary box, just know that the date of release is going to be around October. So mark that on your calendar, guys, because October is going to be super hype. Let's move on with Zenkai Series 5. I got a little bit of information on this set, but based on the information that I do know, I know that we're going to be getting the Z Extra Cards, which is going to be one of the newest hypes in Zenkai Series 5. And we're going to be having a starter deck as well. And the starter deck leader is going to be based on Vegito from the Dragon Ball Heroes prison saga so vegeto is a beast super saiyan god super saiyan vegeto is going to be a leader in this set and it's going to be themed around the evil prison planet so the starter deck is actually going to have z extra cards in it and the z extra cards are going to be revolving around vegeto's iconic beast like move and of course it's going to be the perfect way for brand new players to get into dragon ball super card game so if you don't know how to play i would highly recommend picking up that starter deck in zenkai series 5 now this starter deck is set to release around september 2023 so if you are ready for a super saiyan god vegeto hero style type of deck you definitely want to keep your wallets prepared for september so Zenkai Series 5 is going to be themed around iconic moments and finishing blows in Dragon Ball Sagas. So everything from Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Super, just know some of the iconic moments that they did mention are like the father-son Kamehameha, the Gogeta Soul Punisher, the special beam cannon from the brand new Dragon Ball Super Superhero movie. So Zenkai Series 5, based on the information that I do know, I know that it's going to be coming around September 2023. And I also know that it's going to be featuring the new card type called the Z extra cards and these z extra cards are going to be 
having a brand new horizontal design so probably like how the hero's lineage card secret rare is looking where it's side to side that's where we're going to be getting in the z extra cards they haven't gave that much information but based on what i did find all over the internet that's the info that i got for you guys as of this date and they also mentioned about a god rare coming into the mix. So that's from the official website. I found it right there. It tells us god rare potential. So if there's a god rare, just know that there's going to be extreme hype for that set. And there you have it, guys. I gave you the entire lineup of product that Bandai has announced. There's also premium pack sets where you're going to be getting some exclusive cards and some extra booster packs. Those are pretty cool as well, but... For the most part, I gave you the Goku Black deck, the Zenkai Series 4, Zenkai Series 5, Anniversary Box, and so much awesome Dragon Ball news. If you found this video informative, if you got some value off of this, give me a like, share this to any of your Dragon Ball Super Buddies, and we're going to call it a wrap. Like we always say, y'all stay super. Peace out, guys.